Ah, shield, 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 shield. There we go. Wonderful application of the shield, huh? And my aim is still at 99% accuracy, so that's good news. I'd like to welcome you all to part 12 of Infamous. And this is where things are going to get really exciting. I mean really exciting, because we left off on this tower, the ray sphere's up here, we've met John, and here we go. Oh, a little bit, a little anticlimactic there. Gotta bring Zeke up here, can't forget about him. Or can we? Haha, <laughs> you'll see what I mean in a second. I just got that XP for killing that conduit earlier. What's up with that, dude? Hey, what the hell's going on? There's no one even up here. I know you, both of you. Locked me up like an animal. Tied me to that bed. Tried to electrocute me. I showed you, though. You and those pigs. Here we go. Probably gonna fuck this up. I know that for a fact. But it's bossy time, so let's get this going. I know why you're here. What you want? Nobody's taking a damn thing from me. My only way out of this hellhole runs through you, Alden. And by God, you're not stopping me. You're a fool, boy. Only seen what others show you. But you'll learn soon enough. Can I have that? Do it. Go. This guy decides to get up now. I mean, clearly he was going to. Oh my god. Come on, man. You guys gotta agree with me on that. Like, there's no way on easy that I should be dying that quickly. Even if, like... Even if it's like, oh, you could've used a shield. Like, dude. Like, I died. I was at full health to, like, nothing in seconds there. Mere seconds. Usually easy mode on games are, like, so damn easy. You can take 30,000 bullets, and it's still like, well, I can take another 50,000. You stole my childhood, my home. You dare come here. Poor, poor Alden. All that potential squandered. Your father would have been so disappointed. You dare mention my father. I'll kill you, all of you. Tear you from limb to limb. Seek. Get out of here! Run! Zeke yanked the ray sphere out of its cradle and was caught between Alden and Kessler. It was definitely time to escape. But he just stood there, petrified. You see, through the fear, he realized that the key to his dreams, the tool to make him super-powered, was right between his hands. Asshole makes the choice to kill thousands. Stealing their lives so that he'll be transformed, and then... Nothing. Everyone's fine. No change at all. Kessler's first to grasp the situation. Claims to know what's wrong, 
If Zeke brings him the Ray Sphere, Kessler will be able to give Zeke the powers he craves. My best friend looks me in the eye and then makes his second mistake. Alden goes ballistic at the loss of the sphere. The tower shakes and it starts to rip apart. But I was just dumbfounded. Barely felt the impact. That's right. That's right. Zeke betrayed us. Your karma is unchanged. But my feelings are fucking hurt. I thought there was a boss fight here, but I guess not. It seems very boss fighty of an I area. I told you to pick someone you could trust. 93 seconds. Zeke's my best friend, like a brother to me. He's about the only person I do trust. Or did, anyway. Well, you blew it. And now Alden's on a killing spree and Kessler has the race fear. We need to resolve both situations. 63 seconds. I'm starting to think none of this is my problem. Maybe I should just let those two slug it out and then swoop in and nab the sphere when the dust settles. What if one of them activates it and kills another 10,000 people in the process? And who the hell knows what that Moya person wants with it? No. This is the only way. 38 seconds. You'd better be serious about destroying it. I'm in no mood. You have my word. Alden's heading into the historic district. Catch up to him, take him out, and then look for Kessler. We'll be in touch. Man, oh man. So that's a pretty big major turning point in the game that just happened. <clears throat> Zeke has, in fact, betrayed us. Because secretly the guy's always wanted powers and he kind of has, you know, he's jealous and blah, 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 all that stuff. So, things are about to get really serious. That dude was like dancing. Did you see that? <clears throat> now, John's our, like, last connection. Moya hasn't talked to us in, in a little bit. In a little bit. So... Some stuff's really going down here. Sad news tonight as the CDC announced that its latest attempt to cure the Empire City Plague has suffered a setback. Because of the difficulty in synthesizing large quantities of the cure, it appears that the quarantine of Empire City will continue for some time. That sucks. Alden's tearing across that bridge, heading for the historic district. Stop him before he reaches the other side. I'm on it. Oh, here we go. We're going into the next island, right? Yeah, we are. The next island has the first sons, I believe. The first sons are the um, people of that district. The, the little gang. So it's about it's about to go down, 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 down. I like how Cole doesn't even bring up like all the lies that she apparently told, but he's still not 100% sure on. This is a bridge falling apart, so we gotta be careful here, make sure we don't fall. The first sons, I think I actually liked fighting them a lot, because they were kind of interesting. Their powers are interesting too. Some of the, like, mini conduits, I guess. There's, like, one dude that, like, turns into a real big dude. Boy, I'm lovely at describing things, are I not? Are I not? Is that not, that's not proper English. What the hell's the matter with me? I know you're back there, electric man! Ah, uh, shield, 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 shield. There we go. Wonderful application of the shield, huh? And my aim is still at 99% accuracy, so that's good news. Nope, they're up here. Oh, I love missing. I need to get back up there. I'm not sure how. Oh, guess that'll work.
No, no, no. Really? You won't stop me. No one will. But what if I do it? Ah, see, so you didn't even think of that, did you? Alden, this ends now. Oh, shit. Here's the boss fight I was thinking about. Holy shit. Ignorant pissant! This is what my father wanted. Me, governing all that I could see. My destiny will be fulfilled. You're like Kessler, craving what doesn't belong to you. None of you understand, see the truth, but I do. I see it all. Okay, now I need to make sure I know what I'm doing, that I'm actually dealing damage to him, and I don't know if that's actually just shooting him or not. I'm going to assume it is right now, because trash is like flying off him as I shoot him. And he's just kind of throwing stuff at me right now. Or maybe I can deflect this stuff back and it'll do extra damage. Yeah, I can deflect it. I don't know if that, like, does extra damage, though. It doesn't, it doesn't look like it's even hitting him, so maybe it's not worth it to do that. Oh, that is working. Oh, spiders. What have you guys been up to? Let me know what's going on in your life. I've shared a lot these past few parts. Share with me, please. How's summer school going, Chase? I believe it's still going on when this gets uploaded. I always factor in that it's going to be a few weeks until this specific part goes up. I don't really start considering that nowadays. The relevancy of when these go up. Oh, uh, let me ask myself a question. Hey, Ryan, how was The Last of Us Remastered? It's good, Ryan. Really good. It was a pretty game. Oh, that's good. Don't die. Don't die. Is it, though? Is it? You gotta really ask yourself that, Alden. Is this what you want to do? A lot of kids go into majors and they don't want it. Thief of a friend, all of you. Alden no longer seemed like a threat to anyone, just some old guy howling about how Kessler had stolen his first son's birthright. Then he changed his tone, claimed he wanted to work with me to get revenge, to join forces and kill Kessler. The guy must have felt my hesitation, because in that moment of indecision jumped. No normal man could have survived that fall, but Alden's a conduit. Same rules don't apply. Either way, this thing's coming to a head. My enemies are all gathered here in the historic district. Kessler's preparing them for the final battle. Yeah, this is the finish line. Just wish I wasn't crossing it alone. Right, here we go, the next district. The last district. I think we gotta turn on the power because everything's gonna be off, I think. Two turrets right there. Oh, that's great. Great, 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 great. Now that Alden's out of the way, it's time to move against Kessler. And strategically, though, it's got you pinned in the historic district. Head over to the 19th Street 
crawl bridge and open it. That way you have an out in case things go haywire. 20 seconds. Where are you gonna be? I'll be there when you need me. Five seconds. Heard that one before. Ah, my leg, fuck. Just readjusted my leg and it's really uncomfortable right now. Ah, oh, that hurts, 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 hurts. I gotta work out tonight and it's gonna suck working out because my leg hurts. Out. <clears throat> okay. So this next mission is a filler mission for sure. Oh yeah, drop the dri drop the bridge. It's like okay, well that's not really super important. So yeah, this is one of those filler missions for sure. So what can we so, uh, so what can we uh, what can we talk about? We could talk about cars or people in hoodies or stop sign stop lights or electrical signs or women in Northgate coats. What do you want to talk about? Or more so, what am I supposed to do? Do I have to try this? Yes. I guess so. Because now they're all getting lit. Or is it this? This. Hey, there we go. It's gonna get stuck. Watch. 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 Nope. Okay, I was wrong. I lied. I'm sorry. Hey, it's that bridge that blew up in the first game. Or in the first uh, level. Time together is drawing to a close, Cole, and I fear that you're still not ready to face what is coming. So I've decided to accelerate things, evolve or die, as they say. Shall we begin? Yeah, there we go. That's the dude I was talking about. He gets all big. He doesn't go down. Wow. There we go. I know what Trish means to you, Cole. How much you love her. But we all have our part to play. Even her. And that's why she's sitting here next to me. I've planted a series of bombs across the city. And each is on a timer. Fail to disarm any of them before they detonate. And she dies. Cool! Bastard. I've engaged the timer on the first bomb. You don't have much time. Okay, maybe I was wrong. Maybe this isn't a filler mission. I think this is the mission that's a... Uh... Well, well, we'll see if this is the mission. I think it is. But, uh... Okay, yeah, maybe this definitely is not a filler mission. The prisoners within the electric fence have been killed. You must free them. I didn't know that. I thought I was supposed to... Discharge something or turn something off. Oh, this guy's back. That's good. Ah, Jesus. Hey, we have enough. Yeah, restores a significant amount of energy each time you hit an enemy. Headshots restore health. Yeah, woo. Yeah, we already heard this. We already heard this. That voice, though. That voice is orgasmic, as the women call it. Hell, as I call it, man. It's orgasmic. And she dies. Really? What was that? I think I'm supposed to go over there and just suck the energy out of uh, suck the electricity and then it, it disarms. So we'll just go down there and do that. Without getting shot. I knew I was gonna land on that. Now there's these dudes. And I'm getting shot, and there's oh my god, there's so many people. I don't even know where to begin. So I'll just throw bombs. Yay, bomb time! Oh my god, look at all that fucking XP I'm getting. Holy shit! Ah, oh, mod electricity. Damn. I have never handled a, situ a situation that well before. Now where do I go? 
Really? Gotta kill this one guy. This one guy all the way over here. What is that? Oh, now it gives me the fucking GPS. Alive because of you, Cole. Someone's brother, sister. The next bomb is armed. This guy. What the? F this guy's a psychopath. But who is he? Get in my way, dude. I don't expect you to understand any of this code. Not yet, anyway. But someday, you'll thank me. Of that, I am certain. That's five people now. Five people that will see another sunrise. But I wonder... Did you save them because it was the right thing to do? Or because you're trying to protect Trish? This guy's got some ulterior uh, ult yeah, ulterior motives. Alright, here's the next one. I've started the timer on the next bomb. Man, fuck you guys. I'm getting to the... Oh, shit, that's water. That's water. I'm going to the next one. Get ready for the next battle. It's amazing the things you forget. The smell of someone. The way their eyes light up when they're happy. Those are the things to cherish, Cole. These are a few of my favorite things. And there's something, and there's something. I don't remember lyrics to anything. That's why we should never be in a car ride together. Because I'll try and sing a song, and you'll be like, dude, that's not the lyrics. And I'll be like, sorry, but fucking, I can't understand that guy. Literally every song I ever listen to, like, there's always, like, at least one line in there it's, like, hard to understand what they're saying. Because, like, it's just the fucking, the beat or instrumental or just how they extend their voice. It's just sometimes you just don't catch it. Like, I don't get people that can learn a whole song just from listening to it. Like, I always, that's why these lyric websites are so popular. The final bomb is counting down. And it comes down to this. Your final test. From one roof hangs Trish. The love of your life. From the other, six doctors. Think of all the good they'll be able to do. The thousands of lives they'll save. Which is more important, Cole? The life of one, or the lives of many? Bombs are attached to each platform. You have time to save one, but not both. Choose. Yup. Now the great thing about this karmic moment is, is that it doesn't tell you what's good or evil. The lives of many, or the lives of one. And I'm choosing Trish because I'm a selfish son of a bitch. Because I love her. And I only care about my own preconceived notions before the lives of others. I'm disappointed, Cole. Very disappointed. And chances are this is more from you. I thought you'd be able to set aside your selfishness. See the big picture. Looks like I was wrong. And uh sorry, I gotta put this in. But um this is probably something I would personally choose too, and I know it's the wrong choice, but We'll talk about it after. Trish! Who the hell's Trish? Get me out of this! Oh! Trish! Time slowed down as Trish fell. All my powers, and I couldn't do a thing. For a second, she sprung to life, just long enough to say that she was proud of me for what I'd become. 
Proud that I was helping people with my powers. And that she loved me for it. I buried her in the park alongside others who died since the blast. Kessler's gonna pay for this. I'm gonna find that sick bastard. And I'm gonna kill him. <sighs> man, that does that did get to me, man. That's the third time I've seen that now, because it's my third playthrough, and that does get to me. <clears throat> that fucking sucks. Yeah, that was an evil action I just did. I love I love that. I love how they don't tell you what that what that is. I saw what Kessler put you through. Hell of a thing. Every minute that mad dog walks the planet, all of our lives are at risk. 75 seconds. Where the hell were you? If you'd only helped out, Trish might still be alive. Nothing I could do. She was dead the second Kessler got his claws on her. 51 seconds. Spare me that crap. You just didn't want to put your neck on the line. Expose myself to save one person? I don't think so. But I can help you get some payback. The power grid on the southern half of this island never got updated, so it still uses the old external substations. Turn on all three and you restore power to the rest of the island. Fifteen seconds. And give myself a new power in the process. Exactly. Yeah, man, that's crazy. So I, I really like that they don't tell you what that karmic situation grants you. and It's you up to the player to decide, like, if you're on an evil run or a good run, what do you think is going to be evil or good? And clearly, I mean, I think most people should interpret that saving one life is an evil, selfish action, and saving many is a good action. But here's the, the catch-22 of that scenario. Um, if you choose the good option where you save the doctors... Uh, then it's it's screwy how the game does this to you because it's not consistent, but it you know it does it it should be this way. Uh, if you do save the doctors, then Trish dies because she's not in that group anymore. The the single person is the single person on the other roof is Trish. Whereas if you try and save Trish, uh, Trish is with the doctors. So there is no like consistency there, but that's the whole point, which is you know the the situations change accordingly because. Uh, clearly, it's not about parallel universes. It's about one story where you get to make decisions, and so Sucker Punch chose for it to play out for those scenarios. But either way, Trish dies, uh, which fucking sucks. But it really has good impact either way. And I think it's really one of those things where, I guess, a game that's supposed to offer choice, it doesn't apparently offer choice when it makes when it makes the story advance that way by killing the girl no matter what. Uh, and I guess that's true. I guess that's a pretty good, like, criticism, but I, I would argue that the impact is good. It, it, the impact is still the same, which is what you want, uh, but it's situationally impactful. So you do feel differently depending on the way you chose, where it's like, man, I chose the right thing and got screwed, or man, I was selfish and here's what I, here's what I got in return, which was... Uh, you know, being fucked over by it. I really, I love that part of this part of Infamous, and it's it's one that really strikes a chord with you for sure. <clears throat> Just one of those games that really hits you uh, from a story perspective. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna end it right there, right before we get a new power. So the next part, we will get a new power. So I'll see you then.